Hey everyone, welcome to the Monthly Review, the monthly show on language learning. Where you discover new learning strategies, motivational tips, study tools, and resources. By the way, all the lessons and bonuses you're about to see can be downloaded for free on our website. So click the link in the description right now to sign up for your free lifetime account. Okay, today's topic is the satisfaction of reaching goals. If you made it a goal or a New Year's resolution to learn this language, did you hit this goal yet? Or did you give up a few days later, as most people do with a New Year's resolution? Most people quit and generally don't feel too great about language goals because they've failed too many times before, and so there's no satisfaction there. The good news is this can be easily fixed, so you can actually start your language journey and feel good about reaching goals if you make a small change. So stick around. Today, you'll discover how to actually set and reach language goals how to enjoy the language learning journey, and much more. But first, if you're looking for new free language resources and downloads, here are this month's new lessons and resources. Be sure to download these now before we take them down in a few days. First, the most common adjectives PDF ebook. You'll master over 90 common adjectives with this bonus PDF picture ebook. You can download and review it on any device. And second, can you talk about your feelings? You will with the brand new Feelings PDF Conversation Cheat Sheet. You learn all the must-know emotions in your target language. Download it for free right now. To get your free resources, click the link in the description below right now. They're yours to keep forever. Now to today's topic. The Satisfaction of Reaching Goals. Part one, how to actually set and reach language goals. If you ask most people, learning a new language and reaching that goal is almost impossible for the everyday person. Which is why New Year's resolutions have kind of become an annual joke, where people are all, new year, new me, and then quit a day or two later. But that's because most people also set goals the completely wrong way. Are you guilty of this too? Most people set big, vague goals, like I want to be fluent, I want to speak a new language, or I want to lose weight, or I want to save money. In the case of language, you decide you want to learn, you download an app or get a textbook, you try to stick with it, and by the second week, you're done because the goal is too overwhelming. There's just no way you see yourself becoming fluent anytime soon. And so you quit. And in your mind, it's because it's just not meant to be, because the language is too hard, because New Year's resolutions don't work, or some other excuse. But the truth is, you're quitting because you set yourself up for failure with how you set your goals, and that can be fixed. If you make a simple change to your goals, you give yourself a much better chance of success, and you can actually reach your language goals. What kind of change? Well, instead of aiming for big, vague goals, like I wanna be fluent, you do the opposite. You set small, measurable monthly goals. What are small, measurable monthly goals? For example, Learn 100 words by the end of January, or speak one minute by the end of January. One minute and 100 words are small goals. You're not exactly aiming for the moon here. You can also measure one minute and 100 words. And you have a clear deadline by the end of the month. Either you reach the goal by the end of January, or you didn't. And if you think about it, a goal like one minute is almost impossible not to reach. You need to know maybe 10 or 15 lines to occupy that time. And 100 words, that's just a matter of learning three or four words a day for the next 30 days. And that's the whole point. You make your goals so easy so you can actually start hitting them. And as a result, you hit them, you develop confidence in your ability to get things done. Instead of complaining about New Year's resolutions, and the sky's the limit from there. But just because the goals are easy doesn't mean you'll barely learn anything. Let's say you can speak one minute of your target language by the end of January, then three minutes by the end of February, then five minutes by March, and 10 minutes by June. Speaking for 10 minutes in your target language is a big deal. A lot of people have spent more time on vocabulary apps and still can't handle a basic conversation. So by setting these small goals, you allow yourself to succeed instead of setting big goals and then blaming New Year's resolutions. Part two. How to enjoy the language learning journey. Now, you may wonder, if you're so focused on goals and results, doesn't that take away the fun and enjoyment? And what if you miss a goal? The good news is this is not like school, where there's pressure, where you either pass or fail. 
If you make the goals small and realistic enough, it's not painful at all to learn. Remember, the reason why people quit is because their big, vague goals are too overwhelming to do in the first place. And if you can reach a small goal, that also makes the learning more enjoyable. Suddenly, you feel like you're on the right track. You're getting better. You're speaking more of the language. And as a result, you're more motivated to keep at it. Just think about sports or video games. It's not so fun if you aren't good and you're losing left and right. But if you start improving and if you get good, it's a lot more fun. And that's exactly what happens once you start hitting these small, measurable goals. So to make language learning more enjoyable and actually doable, set small, measurable goals that you can actually reach. Thank you for watching this episode of Monthly Review. Next time, we'll talk about testing and assessment, a brutally honest way to improve your language. If you enjoyed these tips, hit the like button, share the video with anyone who's trying to learn a language, and subscribe to our channel. We release new videos every week. And if you're ready to finally learn language the fast, fun, and easy way and start speaking from your very first lesson, get our complete learning program. Sign up for your free lifetime account right now. Click the link in the description. See you next time. Bye.